This is the hexagon calculator for MadCelebrity.com. A couple ways you can get there. You could type hexagon, or if you know one of the items in the hexagon, you say something like hexagon side equal to 6, or hexagon area equal to 50, or hexagon perimeter equal to 24. So let's do the side first, and then we'll run the other ones directly on the calculator. So hexagon side equal to 6. So this is the calculator. Whatever number you're going to enter if you're on here, you drop in this box. Because we ran a shortcut, it dropped it in here for us. Then you're going to press the button of what you know. So in this case, the calculator pressed the button for us because we know the side. So because we know the side, we're going to calculate perimeter and then area. Now, what if we had entered 36 and pressed perimeter? So now we're going to solve for side. Well, here's the perimeter and side formula, the relationship. It's going to divide out and cross multiply and isolate for us. We're going to plug in our perimeter and we're going to get our 6, which is what we expected from our last problem. And then again, the area formula is going to remain the same since the side was the same. So finally, what if we knew area? <clears throat> Press area. So now it's here's the area in relation to the side. We're going to cross multiply to get this. Divide each side by 3 radical 3 and we've got S squared isolated. We're going to plug in our number for A and we're going to get S squared equal to 36. Take the square root and again we got side equal to 6 which is great. And then because we knew area we want to calculate side and perimeter. So here's the perimeter calculation. So as you can see we can solve for any of the three items in the hexagon. Another feature on this Lesson is the Generate Practice Problem button. It'll generate a random problem for you. And once you're ready, you can press the button. So we knew the side link, so we're going to press side. And again, it, it'll run that practice problem for you. So perimeter is 90, and here's our area. Simple enough. You press the button again, you'll get a completely random problem again. Finally, we have a hexagon quiz generator, which will grade and time you. You can pick how many questions you want and and it'll evaluate your performance. For more information on how to use that, you can visit the video link under the quizzes folder here. If you do have any questions or enhancement suggestions, as always, use the contact us link. Thanks for watching.